say the word happy, then add ness, you get happiness. happiness. And this is a topic, it's kind of fun. Add it to the end, now look what you've done. If you say the word play, then add full, you get playful. Yay. And this is a topic, it's kind of fun. Add it to the end, now look what you've done. and what is the prefix who can tell me what is the suffix and what is the prefix raise your hand huh? the prefix prefixes are a group of letters coming from the beginning of a word like our lesson today mid and miss mid and miss mid means in the middle in the middle mid means what mid means what yeah, in the middle but miss means what bad or wrongly this means bad or wrongly so what does it mean mid alone yeah excellent Yusuf, in the middle and miss what does it mean miss wrongly or bad wrongly or bad okay so mid means in the middle mid means in the middle and miss means bad or wrongly so let's move to the next here our prefix for today so, okay the first word is what can it mid, mid air mid air excellent mid air means what in the middle of the air the first word here has the prefix mid mid means in the middle and the root word is or the base word is air so mid air the word altogether is mid air and it's a noun okay mid air means in the middle of the air in the middle of the air look here look to this kite do you see this kite yeah it is in the middle of the air or it is in the mid air okay the kite flew in mid air and then came back down again so the kite flew in where mid-air excellent boys the next word is midway midway it has the prefix what mid it has the prefix mid and mid means in the middle means what in the middle so midway means in the middle of the way in the middle of the way we have a sentence yeah look to this bus yeah it's a funny bus the bus is moving in the midway the bus is moving in the midway this word has also the the prefix mid and we said mid means huh in the middle in the middle midday means in the middle of the day midday means in the middle of the day 
We eat the midday snack in our class. Okay? Midweek. Midweek. It also has the prefix mid. And the root word here is week. And it's a noun. So what does it mean midweek? Yes, super. In the middle of the week. In the middle of the week. Look to the sentence. Today is our midweek quiz. Today is our midweek quiz. It will be an easy quiz. Mid-year. Mid-year. Mid-year, okay? Mid-year mid -year has the prefix mid. And mid means in the middle. Excellent boys. In the middle, okay? So, in the middle of the year, the word year means in the middle of the year, okay? Okay? Okay. So let me see our sentence. Our mid year break, huh? Our mid year break starts next week. Word mid year is a noun. Mid year is a noun. It means in the middle of the year. Now, this is the time for the prefix miss. What does it mean, miss? Miss means bad or wrong. Bad or wrong. Excellent boys. So, miss means, this means what? Bad or wrong. Say it again. Bad or wrong. Excellent. So, it means bad or wrong. What are the words for mid, for mess? Let's see. Miss place is a noun. So, miss place means what? In the wrong place. In the wrong place. Yeah? Yes. Or? Yeah. He lo lost his, his thing. When you put anything in a misplaced, it means that you lost your thing. You don't find it. You don't find this thing. So misplaced means what in a wrong place or unable to find. Unable to find. Okay? It's also the opposite of find. It's also... The opposite of fine. Fine. Yeah. Our sentence is, I misplaced my phone. What does it mean, boys? What does it mean? <coughs> I, I lost my phone. Excellent yeah. boy. I lost my phone. I can't find my phone, so I misplaced oh, my phone. My. Excellent boys. The next oh, word, mislead. Mislead. Mislead has the, the prefix what? Huh? Miss. Miss means what? Miss means what? Bad or wrong. Miss alone means bad or wrong. So mislead means what? Huh? Look here. To guide or lead wrongly to guide or lead someone wrongly okay to guide or lead wrongly so mislead what to guide or lead wrongly and it's a verb mislead is a verb not a noun it's a verb mislead is what noun or a verb verb so what does it mean, mislead? Huh? To guide or lead wrongly. To guide or lead wrongly. Or to give wrong idea. To give wrong idea. 
It is the opposite of inform. Okay? okay. We have this sentence. They are seeking to misplace, to mislead us by giving wrong directions. They are seeking to mislead us by giving wrong directions. Miss Brent, Miss Brent. Miss Brent has the prefix Miss. Huh. Repeat, it, repeat after me, boys, please. Miss Brent. Miss Brent. Miss Brent. Miss Brent. Excellent. Miss Brent, what does it mean, Miss Brent? Huh? What does it mean? Wrong event. What? To bring wrongly, or you have a mistake or error in your printing. So Miss Brent means you have a mistake in printing. You have an error or mistake in printing. So Miss Brent in this book. There was a misprint in this book. In this book. Misbehave. What does it mean, misbehave? It's a verb. And it has also the prefix, prefix miss. It has the prefix miss. What does it mean, misbehave? To be a naughty. To be a naughty. Or to behave in a bad or wrong way. Or to act in a wrong way. Okay, if you misbehave, you can't come over. If you misbehave, you can't come over. Ah, can you read this word? Yeah. Can you read this word? Mismatch. Mismatch. <laughs> Excellent. It's mismatch. What the prefix here? What is the prefix here? Miss. Miss. What is the prefix here? Miss. What? Miss. Yeah, miss. What does it miss alone? What does it mean? Uh, wrongly. Wrongly or in a bad way. Excellent, boys. So, mismatch means huh? not go well. Not go well. Or it's opposite of match. It is the opposite of match. Look to this socks. Do you see these socks? They are matching with each other? No. No. They are not go with each other. So you can't wear a mismatched, huh? You can't wear a mismatched socks. You can't wear a mismatched socks. Okay? Okay. Okay. Huh. Who the super? Who is the super? And can read this word? Let's read. Let's Excellent. Let's read. Excellent, read. boys. You are all supers. It's misdeed. Misdeed. What does let's it mean? You are doing wrong. You are doing wrong. wrong. When someone is misdeed, it's a noun here. It's a noun, not a verb. So, when someone is misdeed, he is doing wrong. Like what? Like the criminals. Do you know the criminals? Yeah. yeah. The, the people who are inside the prison. He was arrested for his misdeed. He was arrested for his misdeed. No. Mistake. You should apologize or say sorry. Then you will fix your mistake you will fix up your fault or your mistake so mistake means fault mistake means huh? fault. fault or yeah. error look to this sentence i hope i don't have any mistake in my homework i hope i don't have any mistake in my homework she is sad now it's the time for the notebook and open page 533. Uh, we will make a turn. Yeah. Okay, teacher, I will open it now. Okay, open it fast. And I will choose one by one to answer. 
So please mute yourself. No. I only did that. Yeah, I'm just going to cut it. Teacher, I open it. Open it, teacher. Hello, hello, this stuff. Say this stuff. Mark is here. I got a chair. Unmute yourself. Ah, 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 Match. What is the word that has the base word match? It's match. It's match. It's match. It's match. Match. Yeah, it's mismatch. Hi, Abdelazi. What? What's on it? Number two, midweek, 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 brand, midweek, midweek, Miss Brent, Miss Brent, Miss Brent, midweek, midweek. Mehmet, number three, Mehmet. Mehmet, number four, Mehmet. Mehmet, Mehmet again. Mehmet, Mehmet. Hey Yusuf, number five, behave. Miss behave, excellent. Hey, me, Omar, Miss D, Miss D, Miss D. Miss Deer, 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 Miss De